I've seen dogs that were able to predict seizures in advance. We started wondering, how is it they were able to do this? There was something changing in the human body uh, just before, during, and just after a seizure that was causing a smell that the dogs could sense. If we could determine what those changes were, then we would be able to perhaps create a device that could do the same thing that dogs were able to do. There are 65 million people in the world that have epilepsy. There are 150,000 new cases diagnosed in the U.S. each year and 50,000 deaths a year in the U.S. directly attributable to, to epilepsy. 35% of the people that have epilepsy, their seizures cannot be controlled. They live their lives never knowing when they're gonna have a seizure. Not only is it physically difficult, it's psychologically debilitating. We needed to find somebody that could, could help us create a, a device that was small enough to be wearable. We're trying to develop basically a nose that can smell odors that emit from people. There's no other chemical-based test to tell you that a seizure is, is coming. It's a three-part approach with collection, separation, and detection. This would be something that would be worn throughout the course of the day and be constantly surveying the chemistries that are coming off their body. And if the system identifies one of the biomarkers indicative uh, of an epileptic uh, seizure, the system could alert the individual and healthcare practitioners that a seizure is imminent. If we could create a device that could alert them 20, 30 minutes ahead of time, even five minutes ahead of time. It gives them time to, to get somewhere safe, initiate a, a medical rescue protocol that can potentially uh, prevent the oncoming seizure. When we first saw the data kind of coming off live from the clinical samples we were testing, we kind of got that goosebump kind of feeling that it, we think it worked. And that was a really exciting moment for the team. It was remarkable to get that first result and to know that, oh heck, this thing works.